Good evening. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. I'm happy to greet you in the room where the history of architecture means history of art in the Hermitage Theatre at the awards ceremony of the fourth international competition for architecture and design, Golden Cuisine. The ceremony is supported by the State Hermitage and the World Club of St. Petersburgers. The ceremony is opened by greetings to all guests and laureates of the General Director of the State Hermitage, the Chairman of the World Club of Petersburgers, the Chairman of the International Council of Golden Cuisine, Mikhail Brisevich Petrovsky. Dear friends, I'm happy to greet you all in the Hermitage Theatre. Thanks for coming. Thanks for respecting the Hermitage dress code. Masks are especially appropriate, as architecture is the art for eyes and not mouth. So your eyes should be directed at what we're going to show today. I'm very happy to once again present this wonderful ceremony of this wonderful St. Petersburg gimmick in a different language, innovation. Because architecture is art, you know, the conversation about it, whether it's built or not, it doesn't matter. If not, if yes, okay, if not, it may be for the better. It should all be preserved and cherished anyway. It's not a standard conversation, but it's very good, appropriate, and very St. Petersburg style. I'd like to thank all members of the wonderful jury. It's not the peculiarity of this competition. The jury is not just big, but wonderful wonderful people. It's impossible to assemble so many people together, not only in COVID times, but we're in touch all the time anyway. And in advance, I'd like to congratulate all these wonderful people who are going to receive the prizes today. Once again, thank you very much. I wanted to sit here far away, but it doesn't work. But it's still great. At some point, we're going to host in the Hermitage. I'd like to remind you that in the Hermitage State in the mid-19th century, women were seated in one part of the room and men in the other one. It was a quasi-COVID thing. So at some point, we're going to introduce this. Thank you. Dear friends, dear colleagues, the musical program of the ceremony is provided by our official concert partner, Rich Sonat Records. Tonight the ceremony will be the concert numbers of the solists of Yekaterina and Yekaterina is opened with the solists of Catherine Bates. The playlist named the musical director from St. Petersburg includes 40 best compositions of the ensemble. Now Luigi Spence is an artist. Sonata Luigi Schiatti.
Soloists of Katna Great, thank you. Thank you very much. Dear friends, this national competition called the Tsitsin is named after the first architect of Petersburg, Russian Swiss born architect Dominic Tsitsini, has been around since 2018. The slogan of the competition is Architecture as Art. The competition solves the task of mystification of most precious artistic projects, proposals in architecture, design, installation, scenography, and Museums. We are going to works were picked by more than 200 experts from different and they turned into museum objects to preserve them and plot their historical, cultural, scientific, and artistic value. The Church of Dominic Cuisine is a symbol of dialogue with global and Russian schools of architecture. Been the fourth concourse of the Brazil was Oscar for which for the fourth competition of the Brazil, we had 131 proposals from the countries made to the shortlist. Uh, the voters finished and the auditors of the Borneo's law firm approved the results and today we'll, know, we'll name the winners and the runner-ups whose projects will be included uh, in the uh, annual exhibition and the museum fund. Dear friends, so we can be happy to see the happy for the winners. Uh, not caring about the risk, please uh, all uh, keep the um, social distance and stay in uh, your mask until the end of the ceremony. Dear laureates and who is going to perform here, please, when you come up on stage, please don't shake hands and don't embrace anyone, uh, just uh, air kisses. Thanks very much in advance. And for greetings, welcome on stage the Plenty Potentiary Ambassador of Switzerland, Russian Federation, Member of the National Council uh, Board of the Golden Tritsini, Madame Christina Marty Lang. Dear Mikhail Piotrovsky, dear Boris Piotrovsky, dear Vladimir. Dear ladies and gentlemen, dear friends. Уважаемый Михаил Борисович, уважаемый Борис Михайлович, уважаемый Владимир Васильевич, уважаемые дамы и господа. St. Petersburg has, from its very beginning, been a city where people from many different countries have lived and worked together. Specialists from all over the world and many different professions were invited by Peter the Great to bring their knowledge their talent and their hard work here. Начиная со дня своего основания, Санкт-Петербург был городом, где жили и работали вместе люди из разных стран. Специалисты со всего мира и самых разных профессий были приглашены Петром Великим, чтобы передать свои знания, талант и мастерство. We can see this beautiful this beautifully in the city itself, where the architecture is a testament to the diversity of its creators. One of those creators was Domenico Trezzini, who was born in a small village in the southern part of Switzerland. After studying in Italy and working in Denmark, he was invited by Peter the Great to come to Russia, where he arrived in 1703 and has become the first architect of St. Petersburg. Это прекрасно видно на примере самого города, где архитектура свидетельствует о многогранности ее создателей. Одним из таких творцов был Доменико Трезини который родился в маленькой деревушке на юге Швейцарии. После учебы в Италии и работы в Дании ему пришло приглашение от царя Петра I работать в России, куда он приехал в 1703 году и вскоре получил почетное звание первого архитектора города. Together, Russians and foreigners worked side by side to make St. Petersburg the beautiful city of world prominence it is today. Many who had come here as strangers and guests became residents of St. Petersburg and remained here for good. 
Русские и иностранцы работали вместе бок о бок, чтобы сделать Санкт-Петербург прекрасным городом международного значения, каким он и является сегодня. Многие приехавшие в Петербург иностранные граждане и гости стали настоящими петербуржцами и остались здесь навсегда. The motto of the awards, architecture as art, is a testament to the ability of creative processes to bring people together, regardless of their origin, their cultures, and their beliefs. I believe that this ability of art to overcome differences and create understanding between different people is vitally important in the modern world. Devis konkursa Architektura kak iskustva свидетельствует о больших возможностях созидательного процесса объединять людей, независимо от их происхождения, культуры и убеждений. Я считаю, что это способность искусства преодолевать различия и создавать взаимопонимание между самыми разными людьми жизненно важна в современном мире. As the representative of Switzerland, I am especially happy that the awards carry the name of Domenico Trezzini who, as a man from a small, small Swiss village, was able to make a name for himself and contribute to the design and the history of the city of St. Petersburg. His descendants continue to live and work in Switzerland as well as in Russia. Как представитель Швейцарии, я особенно рада, что конкурс носит имя Доменика Трезини, который, будучи выходцем из небольшой швейцарской деревни, смог сделать себе имя и внести бесценный вклад в архитектурно-дизайнерское оформление города и стал частью истории Санкт-Петербурга. Его потомки продолжали жить и работать в Швейцарии и России. The life story of Domenico Trezzini, a Russian architect with Swiss roots, is a testament to international understanding and cooperation so that all may benefit from shared work and effort. История жизни Доменика Трезини, российского архитектора со швейцарскими корнями, является свидетельством международного взаимопонимания и сотрудничества, когда от результатов совместного творчества и проложенных усилий выигрывают все. The Golden Trezini Awards for Architecture and Design is a young project, but has already become a famous event in the four years of its existence. Since the first edition in 2018, it has founded renowned partners, architects and jury members with talented candidates from all over the world applying for the coveted awards. Architekturno-designerski konkurs Zalatoj Trezini, maladoj projekt, no za četiri goda svojevo suštvovanja uže uspel stati zvjesnim sabutjem. S momenta pravidenja prvoj ceremoniji v 2018. gadu on nabriol avtoritetnih partnerov, arhitektorov i čljenov žiri, a talentljive kandidati sa vsevo mira podali zajavki na polučenje prestižnih nagrad. I sincerely hope that this growth will continue and that the Golden Virginia Awards will continue to attract distinguished creators and unite people, different countries and cultures through art. Switzerland, represented by the Embassy in Moscow and the Consulate General here in St. Petersburg, is more than happy to support this prestigious project. Я искренне надеюсь, что этот успех будет развиваться дальше, а конкурс «Золотой Трезини» продолжит привлекать выдающихся креативных дизайнеров и архитекторов, посредством искусства объединяя людей разных стран и культур. Швейцария в лице посольства в Москве и Генерального консульства в Санкт-Петербурге с большим удовольствием поддерживает этот поистине грандиозный проект. And the sponsoring partners who have contributed to the success of the awards. В заключение я хотела бы поблагодарить архитекторов, членов жюри и спонсоров конкурса, которые внесли значительный вклад в его успех. I would like to especially thank Pavel Chernikov and Maria Borisova and their excellent organizing team, which has made this event possible and enabled the awards to become the coveted distinction it is today. I wish everyone a wonderful evening, many interesting conversations and impressions. Особую благодарность я хотела бы выразить организатору конкурса Павлу Чернякову, Марии Борисовой и их великолепной команде, благодаря которой это мероприятие стало реальностью, а статуэтка Золотого Трезини – самой престижной наградой, которая она является сегодня. Желаю всем приятного вечера, интересного общения и впечатления. Спасибо за внимание. 
Thank you very much, Your Excellency, Madam the Ambassador. Dear friends, the organizers and guests and participants of the ceremony are greeted by the Vice Governor of St. Petersburg, Boris Mikhailovich Petrovsky. Dear friends, I'm very happy to be in the Hermitage Theatre and uh, greet everyone on behalf of the Governor of St. Petersburg. Uh, Mr. Biglov and the government of the St. Petersburg. Gilbert talked about the Hermitage tradition and the dress code. And again, many Hermitage traditions uh, becoming St. Petersburg traditions. And St. Petersburg traditions become Russian traditions. Are very much like this Hermitage dress code to go outside of the Hermitage and become our St. Petersburg dress code, the symbol of our security and safety. Since 20. 18 Golden Trezin is going on, and over this short span of time, it will become not only an important part of Petersburg culture, but an intrinsic part of it. We got used to uh, meeting in the Hermitage to discuss the achievements and to give out awards. I'm grateful to the organizers that, regardless of all restrictions, they they find the opportunity to host this event at a very high level. I'd like to thank very much uh, the spectators and members of the jury, of course. Thank you very much and enjoy the evening. Thank you. Thank you, Dibris Mikhailovich. Welcome, head of the Office of the Ministry of Foreign Affairs of Russia in St. Petersburg, the plenipotentiary envoy, co-chairman of the International Council, International Board of the Golden Trinzini, Vladimir Zipival. Thank you. Good evening, dear ladies and gentlemen, colleagues. Allow me, on behalf of the Ministry of Foreign Affairs, to greet you at once again at the ceremony of awards of, of this wonderful statue at this architectural Oscar in our city. I would like to address my gratitude to the organizers, and uh, of course, we're going to talk a lot. Uh, about Pavel Chernikov, who is the founding father, the procreator of this award. And I think that it's his achievement that uh, he's married, that uh, in spite of the hard times, the pandemic, he, uh, he was quick to pick this online format. The members of the jury can vote without coming to St. Petersburg. You know, it's, it's a rather big team of experts. So I'd like to say thank you very much to them. Special thanks go to the State Hermitage, the Club of Petersburgers, for tonight our being in a very significant place, not only for St. Petersburg, but for Russia. The Hermitage Theater. And we all can't wait to find out the names of the laureates, so I'm not going to speak for long, so I wish you a good evening. And may the best get uh, the pr prizes they deserve. Thank you very much. Thank you, Vladimir Vasilievich. Welcome on stage. Chairman of Committee for State Control, Use and Protection of Monuments of History and Culture of Governor of Petersburg, member of the National Council of the uh, Golden Trudzini Competition, Sigurdjevich Makarov. Thank you very much, Mikhail Borisovich. I cannot buy, start with a thanks to our hospitable host. The Golden Trudzini picks the best uh, proposals, best designs in the best museum in the world. Thank you. All ancient Greeks they thought that art is what makes people better. And Golden Trezini is a great has a great slogan. Architecture is art. So today, to present when the nature is uprisen against the man, this reminder of beautiful should make us better. I'm very happy that the Committee for Protection of uh, Monuments is a partner of the competition. I'm really happy that I'm a member of the jury, and I'm happy, I hope that our partnership will keep going. Tonight, we're going to hear 
the names are the winners, the winning projects. Uh, more than 1,000 projects there were. What a task for the members of the jury to pick the best of the best. Some, some may worry, some may win next year. Thanks very much, Pavel, for this great, tremendous work that you and your team are doing. Enjoy the night. Thank you. Thank you, Sergei Vladimirovich. Welcome on stage, the Chairman Committee for Development of Tourism in St. Petersburg, Member of the National Council of Golden Tridzini, Sergei Evgenich Kornev. Uh, good afternoon, dear guests. Indeed, uh, for us, for me personally, it's a great honor to be a part of this event because, indeed, St. Petersburg is a uh, really deserves uh, it. It's, it's, it's a platform uh, that deserves this because it's an open-air museum and it's a living, developing world center. That's how we like to, how it's like to love the world. That's how it attracts uh, guests from all over the world, an interest of guests from all over the world. Of course, at present, it's very important that the city is developing and we acquire new projects and designs, new ideas. And of course, it'll all work uh, in, in years, decades, and uh, centuries. And the most important thing today, that we defining what is going to enrich the uh, image of the city. This is the image that attracts guests. So thanks very much to everyone for this event retaining its, in, uh, its international status and keeping the international status of St. Petersburg. Thank you, Sergei Evgenievich. Dear friends, dear colleagues, and now a very important message. Uh, a pleasant one. Three days ago, the Organizing Committee of Golden Trezini received a letter from uh, the uh, homeland, uh, home country, home city of Dominican Trezini from Lugana. Uh, its mayor, Michele Faletti says, is with uh, warmth that I recollect the words of my predecessor who was not with us, the mayor, Marco Boradori, member of the International Council of Golden Trezini. That's what he told me last year when I made Trezini turn 350 years. Trezini, Astana born, was called by Peter the Great to implement the utopian dream to build a capital between the West and the East that turns to Europe, to cradle civilization. The Golden Trudzini competition continues this tradition. It's unique that it offers a view on architecture through the prism of culture and uh, champions the artistic value of projects. I wish Golden Trudzini every success and congratulations to winter this year in the air. In the end of the letter, Michele, Mayor of Flogetti, Michele Flogetti, agreed to uh, become a member of the International Council of Competition, Golden Trizzini. So give it all up for him. Dear friends, for the first time, a special award is going to be awarded this time. Golden Trizzini, a Genius Petropolis uh, medal. The Spirit of St. Petersburg, the medal was established by the World Club of Petersburgers in honor of uh, the first chair of the club, Valentino Trinolo, who sadly passed away in February this year. In 2019, Trinolo has been, was the member of the jury, and then in the International Council of Golden Trinity, when we talked about this uh, competition being supported by the World Club of Petersburgers, we uh, meant, first of all, her very humane, generous support. Valentino Trinolo did a lot for preserving the inimitable spirit of St. Petersburg, here is the embodiment of it. That's why the World Club of Petersburgers and the Organizing Committee of Golden Trezini decided to name this medal after her is going to be given out annually. The first medal for the architectural restoration project that really fits the uh, spirit of St. Petersburg is awarded to Architectural Bureau Litania Part 91 for restoration of uh, the Nativity Church in uh, the Besky, in the sense, the director of the Architectural Bureau, Yelena Kalev, Skrilov, welcome on stage. The medal is handed out by the president of the World Club of Petersburgers, Mikhail Brzezpiotrovsky.
The diploma is handed out by the chairman of the board of the World Club of Petersburgers, Natalia Nesirukevich. Please. Going to a photo, according to our tradition. Okay, dear colleagues. Thank you. Now, the floor is given to Mikhail Brzezpetrovsky, dear friends. Tina Trofimova has stood on this, stood on this stage many times, and he directed everyone who was uh, entering and uh, at all this all his meeting. He was a wonderful person. When people leave, when they say, oh, now we understand how they meant, uh, how they mean a lot. But we always knew how much she meant for us, Tina Trofimova. She was a great organizer. She could uh, communicate with people wonderfully. She was a very wise tactician in organizing the uh, urban life of our club and uh, a strategist, too. She really understood the, the architectural part of uh, direction of uh, our club's work, and it was with her help that the Commission for Aesthetics of uh, Urban Environment and uh, Black, Red, and White Books and support of the Golden Trinzini competition and uh, a lot of other things that make us uh, important uh, participants of the uh, architectural office in Petersburg. I'm really happy that Golden Trinzini uh, established this medal. Thank you very much. And I'm happy they did the first one to get it. We did a lot with, uh, with your uh, bureau. So thank you very much. We're going to remember Valentin Trofimova. And you got a prize that's beautiful. Thank you very much, Mikhail Borisovich. The floor is given to the laureates of the Spirit of St. Petersburg uh, uh, medal, Yelena Skrilova. Thank you very much. It's, uh, it's a very high award of this competition. And I'm, I'm really nervous. Maybe I, I can speak later if I'm given the floor. Thank you very much. This award says that we're on the right track. Our bureau works for preservation of the cultural heritage of St. Petersburg. Like our the head of our bureau said, if my hands help uh, connect the times in architecture, then that's my Dao, that's my way of life. So we. I consulted my colleagues who put part of uh, their creative life uh, into this uh, property uh, that we built, of which we got the prize. It, this, this, should, uh, this medal should uh, be placed in this temple or uh, this church of nativity or on this keep. Please take your seat. Dear friends and colleagues, uh, guest laureates are greeted by the head of the organizing committee of the Golden Trezini Commission, member of the World Club of Petersburg, Pavel Chernikov. Thank you. I, I've ne never been, I never worried that much as today. Dear ladies and gentlemen, friends, of course, it's a very special competition, more than 1,000 projects, uh, 97 countries, fantastic. But we see that. Uh, it's not only just the number that changes. Uh, it's not about uh, making numbers bigger, but the projects, the proposals uh, are different now. They, they are up to the challenges of today. And our experts realize we were talking not only about art, but about uh, ecology and uh, power efficiency and ecological safety. And we see it in the, this year's proposal. It's great. I think when innovations and new technologies meet, uh, artistic talent, when talented people make this project. Uh, this year is going to amaze us, and it's, it's great to be amazed. I think Tritsini is, is amazement, surprise for me, every, every interesting project. I'm grateful to all our partners. There's many of them. It's hard to list them all. All the committees of governments in Petersburg, all embassies and consulates and directors of museums who support us. It's really great. A special thanks uh, for these wonderful statues 
to a screen uh, jewelers and the Berenius uh, law firm who are, are count the votes. Thanks very much, very much. And the greatest thanks to Mikhail Piotrovsky because uh, to give out awards here is just uh, extraordinary for our competition, for our awards. Not, every, not everyone knows that right here under our feet, 310 years ago in 1711, Domenico Trizzini was building the first uh, stone winter palace of Peter right here in, on the spot of the theater. But when Peter died, he built uh, rooms for Catherine uh, the first, and they're still there under our feet. It's a sacred place for a Trizzini competition. From history to today, there were two people who, in the history of the competition, which really influenced this uh, competition. First is Valentina Orlova, because she gave us the vector for development of the competition. When we were starting, we knew what we wanted, but it wasn't finished, it was finalized. So our conversations, we talked a lot, helped me formulate the idea that uh, right now is, uh, is a motor of the competition and his spirit is not only in this medal, but in our competition as well. The second person who really influenced this competition this year, that's her daughter and uh, her sister-in-arms, uh, Natalia Sirkevich, Natalia Evgenia. Natalia Evgenia. If not for her in this dark COVID times, we would we'd have a tough time. But we have the future. Every year we give out one honorary Golden Trezini competition. This year it goes to Natalia Gene Sidorkevich. A photo, dear colleagues. Okay, give it a lap. Uh, you can hear it online too. Pavel, Natalia Gene Sidorkevich, the floor is yours. Thanks very much. Thank you for remembering my mother. For the prize, I'm really happy that uh, this uh, celebration of architecture is happening in this wonderful place that the competition which each year becomes more and more interesting and brighter and, and uh, it pulls more and more countries and architects. I'm with pleasure that I watched the proposals from all over the world, the projects, designs, and I'm grateful to the members of the jury. And tough job, interesting job, challenging job. Uh, congratulations to the winners and to all of us. I wish health and a great evening. Thank you. Dear friends, now, dear colleagues, now to the nominations, main nominations. I'd just like to ask you, so that we don't really last till midnight and uh, finish tomorrow, we ask all laureates be as laconic as possible. And dear people, guests that are going to give out awards, be as short and concise as possible, although you must be filled with emotions, but don't remember what... Uh, Mikhail Barishi said, uh, architecture is art for eyes and not for the mouth. Okay, you remember these uh, greeting words. Uh, greeting words, welcome on stage, general partner of Golden Tree Zini, general director of Laufen in Russia and Commonwealth of St States, member of the jury of Golden Tree Competition, Igor Levchenkov. Dear friends, uh, the organizers, everyone who put effort and all the energy to support this wonderful project, this uh, competition is very close to us. If you allow us, we always talk about these small particles. It's, you know, the Swiss DNA of Laufen because, uh, was born in Switzerland uh, a long time ago. Next year, we're celebrating 130 years of our brand and uh, our main window to, like St. Petersburg was a window to Europe. Uh, it was axed by Peter. So uh, in the early 2000s, we built we, this window, we axed it. 
uh, from Switzerland to Russia. And this uh, competition, of which we're a partner for the second year on, uh, will allow to uh, discover new names, new trends in architecture. And definitely will we'll be up to the times, the times that pays a lot of attention to health, ecology, safety, everything that allows us to meet and enjoy those new interesting things that uh, comes about thanks to this wonderful uh, participation of competition, whose wonderful projects we can assess today. And we can't wait to learn the results and wish to we wish luck to everybody. Thank you very much. Well, the awards, uh, the Golden Senior Awards, uh, is special for the second year on that most of the uh, winners from uh, different countries cannot come to the ceremony. And they will all receive their certificates by mail, by post, including uh, winners in one of the new nominations of competition to protect culture, to preserve culture. It's not that important to have a university, but it's important to have a library, said academician Mr. Gage Likachov, nomination the best design project of a library. This year, Don Trezini will go to uh, faraway India to winners, Dhruvu Shak and Snech Dhanuk, authors of the point of uh, Resurrection for Forgotten Language, uh, dedicated to preservation of the ancient culture of Gons, of the Gons. Floor is given to the partner of the nomination, member of the jury, director of Langret uh, Region uh, Universal Scientific Library, Irina Simeonova. On behalf of the library community, I'm grateful to the organizers for this uh, library nomination. Libraries uh, are really experiencing uh, an explosion of interest. We, we leave the paradigm of uh, library as a space of books to the paradigm labor library is a space for people. As the mission of the competition is a platform for the best architectural design projects, we think that libraries deserve having the best designers, the best architects paying attention to this developing on the one hand and an internal institution on the other hand. Thank you very much, Victor. Dear friends, best implemented project of temporary or permanent museum exposition. The winner, architectural concept, stillness, Russian classical sculpture from Shubin to Motveev, St. Petersburg, Russia, Circle Creative Studio, Russia, St. Petersburg. The Golden Trudzini and the Diploma of the Winners, given out by the director of Manesh, Pavel Prigara, and the architect of uh, Circle Creative Studio, Maria Ostapchuk. Please. I'll be brief. Let's make a photo first. Sorry, Pavel. Just a photo. Diploma and the prize, just a photo to commemorate this. Thank you very much. Everything we've been doing for the past years related to overcoming and this project was uh, was made in tough times because words of gratitude to all the members of the high jury this uh, prize is especially valuable because of the people on the jury because thanks to Pavel for creating this institution that really picked us out of uh, other wonderful projects and thanks very much to the whole team artistic team of the creative team of this project because the employees of the Russian Museum in Karpova and uh, his, she's alive uh, happily, but she couldn't make it here. And Vasily Barkatev, uh, 
uh, who was uh, a designer of this exhibition. But uh, the Circle Creative Studio, yes, they, they did the great guys, very creative. Thank you very much, Maria. On behalf of the Circle Creative Studio, Alexander Gustav, the main creator, I would like to thank uh, organizers of the competition for this award. Uh, it's a great honor for us. I would like to like say thank you very much to the organizers of Stillness to Manesh uh, exhibition space, Vasily Barkatev and everyone we've been happy to work with on this project. It was interesting, bright, fast, hard, but we made it seemingly. No doubt. Thanks very much, Maria. Thank you very much, Pavel. Dear colleagues, that's not the only exhibition that are going to be awarded today. The organizing committee and the partners of uh, that, that for the unique uh, Lazar Hidekil 1904-1906 Stroganov Palace Russian Museum is getting the award. Lazar Hidekil exhibition, a honorary prize goes to the scientific secretary of the Russian Museum, Alexandra Polinovska. Please. A photo, diploma. Please look, uh, look at the camera. Thank you very much. Alexander Polinovska, please. Good evening. The Russian Museum is grateful. I would like to express its gratitude to the organizing committee and jury for this high assessment of the exhibition. Its implementation would have been impossible without support of Novatech and Victoria Mikkelson. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you very once said, when we talk about architecture, that it's powerless in theater. This is wrong, because a contemporary architect has a lot of work to do in contemporary theater. New nomination, the best implemented theater set design. The first winner in the new nomination, Mozart Don Juan, the dress rehearsal, Mr. Sky of Peter Fomenko, Russia, Moscow. Golden Trizini goes to Irina Ruzhenikova, uh, PA of director of the theater. Please, photo, according to our tradition. You know the format of our ceremony, so the floor is yours, Arena. Good evening. On behalf of uh, Moscow Theatre, Peter Fomenko's uh, studio uh, works, I would like to thank the jury of the competition, the organizers of this wonderful evening. It's a great honor for us. We, uh, in cloud nine, we're really happy. Unfortunately, the director, Dmitry Krimov, could not make it tonight. He's working on his next uh, show. And uh, the artist, uh, Maria Trigubova, she left a message. If you allow me, I'll read it. Dear friends, colleagues, uh, dear jury, it's a great honor to receive this wonderful award. Uh, I'm grateful to everyone. Uh, Peter Fomenko studio and uh, the managers and the, everyone who worked there who spared no effort to implement this hard project and keep working on it. One amazing actors who fill this space with life. Of course, my friends and uh, permanent colleagues, uh, great studios of Scene Pro, headed by Mikhail Abramov, who's a virtuoso in performing all types of set designs and practice creative approach to every task. Set design for Mozart, so John Don Juan, dress rehearsal, once again prove that. Special, special uh, congratulations. I really love the director, uh, Dmitry Grilov, who's really to blame for this. Thank you. Dear friends in theater nomination, there'll be several special, uh, special, special
diplomas, the names of the prize winners will appear on the side of the competition. We'll name just one of them. Uh, decoration of the scenic space of Dmitry Shostakovich's operetta Moskva Chiromishki, Russian Moscow chamber scene of the Bolshevik Theater, Sergei Chuban and Alexander Shayna. An honorary diploma goes to Maria Arlova Shayna on behalf of the architects. A photo. Photo op. Dear friends, dear friends, you organized, let me thank uh, on behalf of Sergei Shumanek Zanashena. Thank you for this diploma and wish you a great Thank night. Thank you. <laughs> on best implemented uh, restoration reconstruction project. The winner, restoration of the monument to Emperor Nicholas I on the St. Isaac Square, Russia, St. Petersburg, the direction for maintenance restoration works for monuments of history and culture. The Golden Tritzini goes to the head of Committee for State Control, Use and Preservation of Monuments of History and Culture of St. Petersburg, Sergei Dimitri Makarov. please. It's a surprising result, given that this object uh, made it uh, to our session program by accident. I persuaded our governor, Georgi Pavlovich, to call one, one sponsor to ask money for this monument. He was ready, but, but the money came from the budget and it went not to the Committee of Culture, it was, it was, but to us, if I'd only known, I would never have agreed because we spent four years on the restoration, two years for design and four year, two years for work, and a lot of a huge team worked on that. We're grateful to the architects of the committee who really put their heart into restoration of this amazing monument. This is the first monument with only two points of support. Thanks very much to the, the, this direction and the company and the team of uh, reconstructors, uh, subcontractors, uh, the heritage uh, studio, Yuri Shidrov and Christina Shamila. Thanks very much. Thanks for your knowledge. And now, once again, music provided by the rich sound art record label, Pietro Locatelli, Caprice C minor number four, from your new solo album of Marie Kristinska, L'Arte del Violin Solo, three different violins are tuned differently with, uh, was used depending on the epoch and the genre and three different bows.
Thank you. Dear friends, dear colleagues, before naming the laureates of the honorary diplomas of the Golden Trizini, I'd like to welcome on stage the systemic partner of the competition, head of the client's experience direction of the RBI group, Vera Sirojina. Good evening, dear friends. I'd like to say that to be a systemic partner of this competition is a big honor and it's very pleasant because we see that this competition is growing stronger and more powerful. Number of projects that uh, participate uh, already make every award uh, more and more important and significant. It's really hard to win here. So I'd like to greet all participants and all organizers and wish everyone huge success. Thank you, Vera. Uh, Russian Seasons Project, uh, forest facility implemented in Petersburg with RBI Group, gets the, receives the uh, an honorary diploma of Gold Fusini nomination, the best uh, implemented restoration reconstruction project, a photograph. Please take your seat. And now, a couple more honorary diplomas. Best implemented restoration reconstruction design project. Recreation of interior of Lyon uh, room of Catherine's Palace, Russia, St. Petersburg. Or a diploma for director of uh, Tsarske Silo State Museum, Olga Tarotinova, and the main architect of the museum, Marina Kalevoriadova. A photograph to commem commemorate this. Oh, but I'm going to stand in front of the table between the microphones just for a better picture. Before it's given to Olga Vlasanova Tarotinova, dear friends, thanks a lot. It's really a surprise because last year we had a prize for a restoration. I'm happy that this year you also know made notes of our work. It's, it's really classy. And to a teamwork, really, did its collective achievements. We're really proud of it. And inviting everyone to watch its slow season. We'll give you a special guided tour. It's closed, but we'll put it, organize this. I have to say that uh, I can promise that uh, we're not going to rest on the laurels and we'll keep participating and uh, striving for victory, hoping for the victory, because knowing that we have very little chance of getting a prize next year, but we will participate. Thank you. Thank you. Congratulations, Olga Vladislavna. Best implemented uh, temporary or permanent museum exposition project. On up monument to Emperor Alexander III in uh, Gatchina, Leningrad region. Honorary diploma is handed to the first deputy director of the museum, Gatchina Museum, Irina Brosimova. Thank you. Photograph. Irina Nikolaevna Brosimova. Good evening. First of all, like, well, I would like to express my gratitude for to organize of the competition and a special attention to the event that uh, is significant, uh, not only for Gatchina's palace. Alexander III's name is uh, interlinked uh, with Gatchina because he spent there uh, the formative years of his life, important years. This monument of Alexander III's uh, ish, monument's issue a bit long time ago, but only in 2018 there was intention to erect it. So this year, on the 5th of June, especially with the President of Russian Federation, Vladimir Putin, it was the ceremonial unveiling of the uh, monument to great Russian Emperor Alexander III. This monument was erected in the Arsenal Square Yard uh, in Gatchina Palace. Now every visitor of Gatchina Palace has a unique opportunity 
to strengthen the perception of the historical figure of this emperor. I'm inviting everyone to watch it and feel the energy of this monument. Welcome to Gachna Palace. Enjoy the night. New victories and implementation of new projects. Thank you. Thank you, Nikolaevna. The best uh, implemented restoration construction project, runner-up, uh, prize winner, restoration of Yelagin Island Palace with a full reconstruction of historical interior of Alexander I study. The honorary diploma goes to the director of Central Park of Culture and Rest, named Dr. Kirov, Pavel Andrej Silesnyov. Congratulations, photograph, <clears throat> and for is yours. Good evening. Thanks a lot. It's very pleasant. I know that due to this tough uh, pandemic situation, very few people have been to our palace. Um, welcome, everyone. You'll really enjoy it. It, re it literally looks great. We made it, and uh, and uh, VIP reception and uh, free ticket for the members of the union. I would say the password is Trizini. Code word uh, Hermitage. <clears throat> the best implemented reconstruction restoration project uh, runner up uh, restoration and repurposing for the five star hotel of the Vavelberg's banking house. Uh, a cultural heritage object, this on diploma, uh, goes to the head of the ASM group, Jakob Pesin. Uh, Anna Kuznetsova uh, in sales and operation and Rosanci Chinawa, the personal director of the hotel, Wavelberg. Some photos for the history. Dear colleagues, I'd like to thank all the organizers and members of the jury. This. Uh, Competition. Thanks so much to Alexei Mikhailov, put, put part of his heart into this uh, signature building in the beginning of the Nevsky Pro Prospect, Nevsky Avenue. As members of the Five Star Hotel, it's already open. It's a great honor for us to work in this very significant building that uh, start living its own life inside. And uh, tonight, many of you will have a chance to uh, really uh, appreciate the interior of a Babelberg's house from the inside. ASM group, Alexei, say, say something, say your thanks. Good evening. It was a long and tough project. Come lost to, together with the Litane part. We really passed the uh, baton to each other, the banner. So we, it worked out fine, just great hotel. Our, our cooperation is going on. So ev every facility. You, 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 you're talking to each other, talk to us. It's, uh, thank you very much. Everyone uh, really wants to, to hear how friendly you are who work together. On with the show. Nomination Best Implemented Landscape Architecture Project. The winner, Veretiva Park, Russia, Moscow region. Architect Alexander Brodsky. Golden Trizivia is given to the manager of Viretiva Park, Nikita Ostapov. Viretiva Art Manor. The award is given out by the general director of the Russian real estate fund, member of the Golden Trizini competition, Alexander Portnov. Please don't leave. <coughs> Alexander Portnov. Thanks very much. <coughs> it's a great honor to be present and to give this award. This room, this 
competition. Now, when we voted for this project, we had an impression that preservation of nature and what uh, this respected nominee's deed did, it's like passing from one generation to another to the next generations of this beauty, this nature, this purity. We think that uh, this approach, preservation of ecology, of nature, is what should be passed from generation to generation. It's very valuable, very organically performed. So from the bottom of my heart, congratulations. Thank you very much, Alexander Semenovich. Nikita Stapov. Unfortunately, Alexander Semenovich couldn't make it to the nomination, but we really value this prize, this award. It's great we're starting to revive the culture of parks and to do it in the framework of this landscape art. Thank you very much. Congratulations. Now, dear colleagues, two more prizes, special nomination for the best uh, apartment graphics of a uh, residential complex. Etalon for Visage Complex Etalon on the Neva. On the proceeding goes Mirovich Volodin, Vice President of Etalon Group for the St. Petersburg region. What is given out by Fedor uh, Vasilyevich Director of Alexander Real Estate, member of the jury of Golden Prizini. A photograph. Ferro Sistichkov, the floor is yours. Dear colleagues, dear friends, as a realtor, I really understand that uh, apartment gra graphics really influences the quality of consumers' quality and the quality of life in this, uh, and its price or this apartment. It's a simple task. I mean, planning uh, an apartment, but there are many apartments inside one project. It is a very non-trivial and tough task, especially when you have to, uh, have to maintain the architectural style of the project. And its uh, performance was great. Uh, the Atalon uh, company uh, project at Alon on the Neva and sincere congratulations to one of the leading developers in Russia and wish him success in the future. Good evening colleagues. Thanks a lot to the organizers of uh, uh, this award is really uh, pleasing to receive it here because we only uh, experimented with our first project. Uh, we made uh, flats on the first uh, ground floor, and there are two, level, two level floor flats. And uh, but it's a very important uh, award, so we know we're on the right track. Please take your seats. Mr. Lynch, please stay. Wait a second, stay here. We have another prize for you. Special nomination from a uh, our partner of the competition of many years, Stroy Video Company. Floor is given to the founder and director of Stroy Video, Igor Glagolev. Good evening. This year we came up with this uh, nomination, best visualization of brand. Thanks very much, and would like to give it to you. Thank you very much, Igor. It's all for the memory. It's a souvenir. Special nomination, the best uh, art space project in a new residential 
area. Settle group for the Svetlana Park residential complex. Golden Trizini goes uh, send it out to the head of the press service of Settle Group, Inga Yarosh. An honorary prize and diploma of the winner. From a creator of the digital platform Restorate Ru and Project Petersburg 2.ru Andre Dobry. It's, it's one year to go before the reception. Oh, no. Dear friends, I was recollecting. What, what, what time it is uh, for, for me at, at the, uh, the uh, awards. It's only fourth time, but uh, a lot of work has been done. Congratulations to the winner. I'd like to say that this is a project that really promotes our city and uh, connects architecture and real estate and art. Congratulations. Great awards. Great competition. Thanks a lot. Inga Yarish. For is yours. Dear colleagues, thanks very much. I'm really happy, we're really proud to receive this very significant award. This project is in a stage of implementation, but we're sure that we will live up to your trust. Won't let you down. It will be a very deserved of our wonderful city. Well, they both hit your wonderful city and our photograph. Thank you. Please take a seat, dear colleagues. And for the winners and the guests of the ceremony, again, music, the soloist of Catherine the Great with the support of Rich Sound Art Label. E minor sonata for uh, violin and clavecin by Ignatius Bach, Andrei Shedin and Rina Schneira. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank
Irina Shnerova, Andrei Reshetin. Thank you, colleagues. On with the show. I mentioned the best implemented creative space design. This nomination appeared this year thanks to the partners of the competition. Imis Business School and Avant Garde Mercedes Benz. The winner, Sev Kabelport, Russia, St. Petersburg. Miles and Yards. Representative of the company Alexei Anatska is receiving Golden Trizini. The Golden Trizini statuette is handed out by the director for sales of Avant Garde Mercedes Benz, Vladimir Chernikov. A diploma is handed out by the rector of the Emis Business School, Yaroslav Pavlov. According to our tradition, the photograph. The floor is given to Yaroslav Pavlov. Colleagues, uh, good evening. It's, it's a pleasure to hand out this nomination to Sev Kavalpov, but really it's a, it's a very significant uh, project for our city. Creative space is a place where art meets business. So today we decided that uh, it's, it's appropriate. Uh, I should give out the diploma because I'm used to you know, diplomas to heads of important uh, establishments. Because I'm representative of business school, we have an executive MBA. It's the key area. It's uh, great that this uh, project won. I, I hope that you will keep contributing immensely to the development of our city, development of business in our city, and art creation. Thank you. Thank you. Vladimir Chernikov. It's the first time we participate in this project. We really like it. Thanks to Pavel Chernikov. We think that art is a great thing. I'll not repeat Mikhail Petrovsky. Mercedes-Benz uh, is art of cars. This company that was first to produce an invented car, Damien Benz invented it, and since then, art is implemented through us in car building. This, thanks to this concept, we became partners of this uh, award, uh, Golden Trizini, and we're happy that this award went to our this uh, really uh, advanced uh, space. Alexey Anatska, dear friends, colleagues, it's a pleasure to receive this award, not me, the whole team, they all say hello. I'd like to note the Hawaii Architectural Bureau that has been helping this project along the way all the time. And it's not just, it's not implemented yet, it's a new project. We're happy that we managed to show our local business and culture and art can change the image of uh, whole quarters of St. Petersburg, uh, districts of St. Petersburg, and open them up for St. Petersburgers and tourists. Uh, so your support is very important today, especially. Thank you very much. Thanks very much, everyone. Please take your seats. And now Trizini goes by post to a faraway country. Nomination, best student, uh, best project of building facility by student. Uh, Shepherd's Abbey, Great Britain, Scotland, Christian Joey Lasso Gongora, student of Panama University. Gon Trizini is handed out to the deputy head, deputy chair of the organizing committee of the government, Rezina Nikolska. She's receiving it for the winner. Golden Trezini is given out by partner of the nomination, director for marketing of Lens for Trace Group of Companies, Jan Feldman. Good evening. It's not the first time that we've been the partners of this nomination. It's very important for us for that young architects, including ones from Russia, could uh, implement their brave ideas in architecture. But looking back at uh, historical context of where they 
are implementing this architecture where they work. Thank you. Thanks. If we give it to Olga, yeah, there'll be the photo will be correct. Thank you. Thank you, Jan. Thank you, Olga. No. Best implemented interior project with the use of works of art. Law laureate in this nomination will get a special prize uh, and offers uh, sculpture of Pavel Ignatiev, uh, of uh, the Golden Trizini, the winner, Office Studio Designing, Russia St. Petersburg. Golden Trizini goes to the founder of the designing studio, Anna Sargisians. And the member of the jury of our of uh, our competition, sculptor and uh, resort Pavel Ignatiev, is giving out this uh, pair of compasses of Golden Trizini. Pavel Ignatiev, the floor is yours. Good evening. I'm happy to see you all. Uh, congratulations on this wonderful uh, event. Four years. Congratulations to Pavel and everyone who believed in the this competition in the very beginning. And congratulations to the winner in this uh, nomination when this competition was just starting. The awards, Pavel and I were discussing it. I just recollected that talking to many architects, uh, since we talk a lot, they say it's private uh, projects of houses and big uh, apartments they last a lot of time when uh, so there are, uh, there are certain emotional bonds between uh, those who uh, commissioned the job and the architects. So when it, we've reached the final line, when the finish is there, there's no uh, really uh, uh, energy left to fill it with art. So I think that they must, you must find some energy for that. I think this nomination would be really cool. So Pyle supported it. Thanks very much. So this year, I'm very happy to give it uh, uh, hand out this prize, but it's, it's not for our interior, but it was Architectural Bureau. Whence come these uh, ideas, and these projects? Thank you very much. Congratulations. Thank you, Pavel. Good evening. I would just like to thank, of course, the organizers of the competition and the members of the jury. Out of a thousand projects, you are picked ours. It's very uh, valuable for me to receive prize in this nomination because I'm not an architect or designer of interiors, I'm also a collectioner. So this award, that's everything. That's profession and hobby put together. Thank you. Thank you very much. Photograph. Next nomination is very special because its main prize is Trizini. It's not golden, but ceramic. We value very much our partners from the Museum of Architectural Ceramics, Karen Mark, that three years ago suggested uh, this idea to us. The best implemented facade into a project using ceramics. Winner, marine style house, Portugal, Cascais. The ceramic Trizini will go by post to the Portuguese architects from Subvert Studios. Subvert Studio. Floor is given to member of the Golden Trizini jury, head of museum of the artistic art ceramics, Karen Mock, Constantine Lichalat, dear friends, good afternoon. Thanks very much to the organizer of the jury and sponsor of the wonderful competition. The ceramic uh, embodiment of Trizini that goes to Portugal this year. Special prize established by the Museum of uh, Architectural and Artistic Ceramics. It's a museum of architecture in St. Petersburg. It's great that it's the third time on that we're giving out this uh, prize in the four year history of this competition. And the organization of the competition is better. And there's more participants and more participants in our nomination. 
and the geography is expanding. It's great that together we're working on this rethinking of uh, architectural and artistic ceramics. So maybe in future we can really expand our horizons. Since architectural ceramics is not uh, just patterns and uh, facade ceramics and uh, kitchenware, but that's what uh, what we in our team, in our museum, we see, see as the main project of this competition. The Soviet studio, bravo to them. The prize found its winner since ceramic is very complicated, complex in this marine house facade. We as ceramists, we can really appreciate that. And it's very rich in aesthetics, but it's also very functional. But that's not just it. This is to Pavel to send to the winners. As a museum, we look not only in the future, but also in the past, not only forward, but also backward. So this year, we'd like to commemorate a friend who passed away, a friend of our city, architect, uh, real architect, uh, Grigory Mikhailov, who recently left us, passed away. And it's a pity that this prize, this ceramic Tuzini, that uh, we were uh, brave enough to decorate especially because this architect took part in revival uh, uh, of Menshikov Palace, of Winter Palace of Peter that Pavel mentioned already. Many others. He was uh, professionally participating in many other monuments. Unfortunately, we're going to learn it personally, but we give it to his uh, follower, Alexei Grigorievich. Please, thank you for this trizini. It's very important. I would like to. As a follow-up to words of Konstantin Pavel, that it's an unusual building. It's not just a theater, Hermitage Theater. Thirty years ago, when the restoration of theater was finalizing, my father was the main architect of this project. There are some interiors left here where we really understood the restoration and uh, the main stuff was found under this room when we found the first Winter Palace of Peter the Great, Peter the First. And according to our cover data, we could recreate the interiors, not just Winter Palace, but in this Winter Palace. Very few people know. Peter uh, celebrated his wedding under this room. And in the palace, uh, uh, the lost rites were given to the Tsar for 20 days. It's a very important, significant place. We in our company, we keep uh, the restoration traditions. Very actively, we use ceramics in restoration. So thanks very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Steve Viktorovich. Oh, special nomination of Lazar Kidekel Prize for the best innovative architectural project. The laureates of the award are chosen by the special board of experts of uh, Lazar Kidekel Society, including several Golden Trizini dream members, Daniel Libeskind, uh, Mark Hidekel, and others, architects. Lazar Hidekel is a bright representative of Russian avant-garde, uh, the first suprematist architect. Life of Holy Kector was uh, linked to St. Peter Leningrad, where he studied, designed, taught, and what's very important, since early 1920s, worked on 
ideas of futuristic settlements. The laureate of uh, Los Prize in 2021 in the Center of Art, Sciences and Human in the 21st Century, Mervita uh, Apulia in Italy. Lazar Hidekel Award will go by post in Italy to Professor Donato Di Gaetano. Other runner-ups of Hidekel Prize will be named on the site of the Golden Trizini. Dear friends, dear colleagues, another musical present for the laureates and the guests of the ceremony, Capriccio for the world premiere of the uh, album of English astronomer and composer Willem Gershel, performed by specialist on rare Baroque music, Andre Pinugin. Andre Pinugin, thank you. Now, dear friends, two special prizes from our partners, the Interior Line. First prize winner, Venthausen Mont Blanc Residential Complex, Union Novic Architectural Bureau, head of the Department Marie Ospoa, the second prize winner, Library Tolstoy Salon, Russia, St. Petersburg, Centralized Library System, Ovisysovsky. District Director of the Library, Valeria Kalina, welcome on stage, the prize winners. The runners up, runner ups. The prizes are handed out by our PR Director of uh, Interior Line, Alona Alexeychikova. Photograph, please. Floor is given to Alona Alexeychikova. The, the general interior line for 25 years has been creating successful interior solutions in the premium segment. Since the, the, year, the first year of this uh, competition, we've been supporting Golden Trizini every year. There's more and more candidates, uh, deserving candidates, and we decided to give the special prizes to these uh, winners' nominations. Wish you success, promotion, and and great evening. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Please take your seats. Dear friends, in different nominations or competition projects from many cities and countries, one they couldn't make it, CETES will, will go to them by post. And now let's just name the winners and see their works really fast. The best architectural design for museum. Geological Museum in Malaga, Spain, Fit Design Architectural Studio. Best project residential estates with Living Zunu, Mexico, architectural studio Sunspond. The best implemented project of residential estate, Freebooter, the Netherlands, Juju Loop Architectural Bureau. Best project of public building or facility. View, viewing platforms, uh, 
in Iceland, 00 Group, the best implemented project of public building of facility, Bambo Bambo, China, Architectural Bureau, LL Lab. The best implemented project of interior design project for public space, entry hall of uh, our residential half Israel. Uh, architect. Best project of landscape architecture is from Singapore, Alejandro Maria Guerrero. The best project for private residence, Villa Volca, Salvador, Molina Architectural Studio. Best implemented project of private residence, Casa de Laje Inclinada, Brazil, Tetra Architectural Studio. The best implement apartment private house into design project. House of Handmade Experiments, China, ZZ Atelier Studio. Best project of public space by student. Winner. City of Garages, Russia, Yaroslav. The others are graduates of Yaroslav State Technical University, Anastasia Daniel Admirov, the National Premier del Publico, the Views Award. Oasis of Life, Italy, Level Group Architectural Studio is the winner. Dear friends, our ceremony is closed by. The soloist F. Catherine the Great, once again, is a link to musical Baroque from St. Petersburg. You can see it on our screen. I'm happy to introduce the performance. Irina Schneira, clavicino, harpsichord. Irina Yakolev, Baroque. Uh, Andrei Pinugin, Baroque violin. Andrei Rishetin, Baroque violin. And artistic director. Johan Helmik Ruman. Johan Helmik Ruman. Pieces from Golovin Music and Suites. Created by commission of uh, Count Golovin for celebration of coronation of the Peter II.
Soloist of Catherine the Great. Thank you, colleagues. Thank you. Dear friends, our ceremony is coming to an end. Uh, all project winners of Golden Cuisine 2021, right after this uh, soiree, will be published at the goldtradezine.ru. We thank the employees of the organizing committee for the competition, responsible for handing out the statutes and diplomas, Maria Borisova and Maya Lungu. Thank you very much. A wonderful, well done, great job. Once again, congratulations to all nominees, laureates, thanks to the Home Touch, thanks to the International Council and International Board and the Selection Committee and the jury of the guests of the ceremony. Great thanks, special thanks to the partners whose logos you see on the screen. The ceremony is all dear friends, which we're not saying goodbye because, because the buses are waiting for the guests of the ceremony. They will take us to the celebration uh, reception and good luck to everyone. And I'd like to remind you that next year, Gold Resini has its first jubilee.